Here is a amateur radio emergency radio kit I put together using an ICOM IC28 mobile although any other mobile that will fit in the case will work fine. What you're looking at is a uh, control panel, a DC control panel from West Marine just because it was faster to put the kit together. I used a fan from an old computer power supply for forced air cooling and inside of the case there's a Samalex 20 amp switching power supply. I have AC control power here which I just have. Uh, I also took the uh, AC power cord and remoted it from the power supply so you can turn on and off the power from there. You have 12 volt metering capability to see your uh, 12 volt power. You have a cigarette lighter plug in case you need to plug in a cell phone or any other accessories in the field. Uh, in the back I also have a uh, Anderson power pole separate input in case you want to run the kit from external power. Also made up a couple of uh, battery clips here with uh, Anderson power pole. Uh, the kit is uh, watertight with this seal. This is a 19 inch uh, rack panel that was cut down to fit into the case. The What's holding it to the Pelican case itself is the Pelican rail kit made for this case. And this kit is pretty much self-contained except for a coax cable and your external antenna. The uh, a quarter wave mag mount will fit in the case and I keep that with it. I also have a 5.8 wave 2 meter antenna that can fit right in the back here with a right angle adapter BNC to PL259. And this will handle field operations no problem give you a good 50 watts out on the, on the fly and uh, I think uh, if you're looking to build something you uh, that's more presentable you need to do something like this to uh, take it into places where it may be seen by uh, the public view first impressions are everything and if you can do a halfway decent job you're better off this kit was built by K70 Aloha